is shooting the basketball. Harvey and Mooney with some miscommunication, but the Irish keep it with Fluger now to Harvey. Harvey drives in, now kicks out to Mooney, same spot, same result. He's got that spark, spot mark down there. An experienced team that knows how to utilize the transition game. Tanner tries a long three, that one's good. All three of those freshmen. Great movement again, and, the, and again, the swing offense here. Here's Mooney, tries number four and hits number four. Last year, and so far, a 1-0 mark in the Gotham Classic, looking to make it two if they can get the W over Radford, but the Highlanders hanging in there, only down by three. Well, job on Tanner, that was uh, evident, but then they were able to get the ball inside. Polite back the other way, the spin around Fluger, and Polite throws it down. Fields, now inside to Holland, a spin move on Mooney. Holland finishes with the left hand, Highlanders down by one. The screen from Mooney, now into Mooney. John Mooney. Forcing a guard here on him, and you know, the, didn't reward the guard by flopping there, and I love that as a coach. Three from Hicks was deflected, but stolen right back by Fields. Fields will try Hicks again, and Hicks connects to tie it up. The shot clock out to Fields, he's gonna have to hurry. Now forces a shot over Fluger, and Travis Fields connects. Wow, what a great shot. I'm hoping they can get a last shot here, a big bucket here in the last uh, 58 seconds. Light working on Mooney, and the Highlanders are up five. Ram into the bucket. So on one end you have the Gibbs free throw that hangs on the rim and goes out. This time Polite has it hang on the rim and the little friendly roll on the on the road. It easily could have been called a foul Absolutely. as well, you know, because it looks like he got his hands on the ball. But you know that's what gives coaches a lot of great. Gibbs with the right hand. Mooney, the tip in is good. Work on these things at the end of practice every day, but uh, this is a big opportunity here. Here's Gibbs for the three. No good. Radford comes into Purcell Pavilion and pulls off the 63-60 stunner over Notre Dame.